Oh, well, back to Fog Racer. We're here with the Avo Paisan Grand Prix round six. And let's dive in to our wee race preview because Max Verstappen leads the championship by what four points, and then there is like, I mean, and we're talking like forty nine points back to the next guy. Norris. There is no Lando Norris is in third. Right. Holy Again, shit! Four. See the Bottas or Perez? Nah, it's Bottas and Perez, Leclerc, Sainz, Ricardo, Gasly, Ocon, Vettel. Stroll, Alonso, Sonoda and Giovinazzi and the rest are non-scorers so I'm not going to mention them. See odds wise to when the uh, constructors with the top two teams, McLaren are favourite. Now I know, I know Norris has got them a, a hefty amount of points but I'd be surprised if McLaren over the course of the season outscore Ferrari. Yeah. I mean I, I think by the end of the season I think Leclerc and Sainz will both have more points than Norris. I do. You look at Monaco, I like, could very easily win a 1 3. So, I mean, you know, I, I mean, I think like something like McLaren, like 4 to 6, Ferrari 6 to 5. To me, that's. I guess the only thing, if Ricardo turns up and does what Norris can do, maybe McLaren are favourites. I do think they have got the quicker car, but. Who did McLaren have her? Yeah, overall, I think they've got the quicker car. No. Yeah. I would I'd take both. For uh, well, yeah, well, yeah, I'm, like I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just stating the facts here, but we're not here to talk about season because we already did that at the start, and we'll be a, I'll be a, I'll be a laugh checking that at the end of the season. But anyway, yes, preview for Azerbaijan, Flexi Wings is the, the talk. Red Bull, Ferrari, and Alpine are using them, so expect those teams to go strong. Apparently, six tenths on the straight. That's Mercedes saying it, so it's probably bullshit just to make them look like probably, uh, probably more like six fucking yeah, hundreds. See, Total Wolf tried to blame Bottas for that pit stop. Did he? Aye. Well, he'd never done that in Hamilton. He, he said. He, he, see, he, if Hamilton had that pit stop, he'd still be apologising to this day. Exactly. He said um, he, he went oh, too so far in his box. How would that cause the fucking wheel to fucking not not to come off? Exactly. It's because the fucking the guy with the wheel gun didn't do it. Didn't line it up. That's the fucked up guys. But anyway. Alex or Pajan, brava. Um, you know what? Normally, this is always a great race because for some reason it turns into a demolition derby. And um, aye, right, so let's dive into qualifying. Your top five, boom, go. Max. Oh. Max Perez, one two. Fuck it, I'm going for it. Red Bull uh, Perez is going to turn uh, up this week. All right. Um, I'd say there's more chance in the race of being a one two than Quali for some reason. Uh, Perez is actually good at Baku, two podiums. Hamilton third, Leclerc fourth, Sainz fifth. What about Bottas? He needs a fucking win. I know, but I, I think I think Monaco just fucked him over. So you think that's him done? Aye. You think George Russell will be in a seat next season? Yeah, well, I think it's pretty much already. I'd say so. Yeah. You know. Right. Well, I don't know. Like, I don't. I, they won't like that Russell Hamilton dynamic. Um. Right. Anyway, I'm going Max. Bottas, Perez, Hamilton, Norris. I think. I think McLaren will be better. You're going Hamilton Ferrari. fourth. Uh-huh. I think Bottas needs to turn up. Like, not well, that he did in Monaco, by the way. They say, <laughs> well, they say that maybe Bottas not letting Hamilton through in Spain is maybe a sign of that's him being told you're done. Or maybe he's like, hold on here. Kind of mad, like if it is, if he is done. He's only five races into this season and he asked him, he's literally at the title race. Oh, that was, oh, well, that was four races in. Not Spain, really. Yeah, but I'm on about now after Monaco. Ah, but I'm on about, well, you're talking about, ah, I know what you mean, but you're talking about the Spain he already knew. No, I'm saying in Spain, I think he already knew that. He was at the title race? No, that he was at the seat. And that's right. why he wasn't willing to play second fiddle. Aye, fair enough. But now I think. Hold on! If you're at the seat by the fourth race, what was the fucking point of keeping him? Because a total, a total wolf really shocked about how the seat. I, I, he's been unlucky, fair enough. But he was never going to challenge these two. I don't know. Could they? Could they be contracts or something? Like I mean, what do you mean they were contracts? Maybe, maybe, maybe the days they no, the but year, but maybe year, maybe, maybe Will thought it was better to have bought us as Hamilton's teammate this year than Russell. Why? Maybe he thought Russell would benefit from one more year at Williams. Next year, new regulations. Is there anything you want Russell in the team to give him a year to get used to it before you go into the regs? You know? I disagree. I, 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 maybe he thought. Oh, it's just fine. No, 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 maybe he thought, well, we put Russell into the, the Mercedes, it's a change of car, and then next season, it's another change of car, so we'll wait till 2022 to bring Russell in, and it's a change for everybody. That's why I didn't Alonso just wait then. Because Alonso's getting fucking old. Alonso can't wait. Oh, yeah. 
if anything, Alonso should have came back last year. But he, he, held, he postponed it, like, because of the regulation, re, regulations postponement. But, you know what I mean? Aye. Um, boom, boom, boom. Right, anyway, race predictions. I will go with L, Max. I just don't see, how, I don't see how Bottas keeps his seat when you've got Russell there. Then they're also on about their, their high on Ocon. How many years do you want to waste with these? Like, before you is go Ocon not still? Yeah, but I don't think I don't think they're going to bring him. What about the other guy that's in the Mercedes test? Fairly? Oh, he's fucking he's in Formula E, isn't it? I know, but <sighs> it's also I mean, who watches Formula E? It's fucking garbage. Anyway, my, my top ten. Well, if Hamilton retires and we know Bottas is pish, and fucking Ocon crashes and dies or something. They might have to go back to Pascal Fairlane, so, I mean... Would they? They'd just fucking buy Max. No, that's true. Or Leclerc, or somebody no, else. I probably would do that, like, I. Alright, see you, Alonso. I know you've been pissed this season, mate, but you're a draw, so guess. <laughs> Michael Schumacher, are you? Yeah. Fancy me return? Yeah, hey. I'm kicking, buddy. Anyway, right, my top ten. I'm going with Max, Perez, Bottas, Hamilton, Leclerc, Sainz, Alonso, Ocon... No, fuck, where's my McLaren's at? Fuck it. Norris 9th and Ricardo 10th. A very Noah's Ark grid, which just means it fucking won't be, so I kind of botched that, I don't give a shit, no elite prediction. Um, I'll go again 1 2, Max Perez. I want to see a race where Perez is actually. Fuck it, I'm going there. Perez, I'm going Perez to win. I want to just see a race where Perez is up there. Battle, yeah, you know, and he's not starting 11 for something. Or loses positions at the back to start. start yeah. I'm going to go Perez to win. I, can, I think Perez has got a good record in Baku. I think his tyre management's better. I mean, this is normally a one stopper. Guys, they took the softest tyre, so it might not be a oh, one stopper. Well. So, but who knows? Um, <laughs> plus, there's overtaking, like, I mean. Yeah, exactly. Being on pole here definitely doesn't guarantee you nothing because. Even at, coming out of turn three, you've got that pr pretty long straight into turn four, and there's always like overtaking opportunities there. Like, see, a lot of tracks are like you, at the start, it's, it's like mo you have to you have to take the chance into turn one, or you don't have it. Mm -hmm. Whereas this track, I don't think it's like that at all. I think hey, you maybe be better. I, I think you're better off maybe not even attempting to overtake into turn one and just lining up the car properly. See if you can force uh, Max. I think turn one's up. Fuck it. I think no, but like, see if you can force Ma Max to like take turn one pretty narrow. Oh, yeah. Obviously, he's compromising his exit. So yeah. if, if you can like pretend you're going to dive down the inside, so he comes over to cover you, then you actually sweep out and take it wide. I think it gives you a really good opportunity to overtake him down into turn four. But anyway, I'll go Max. I'll go Perez, Max, Hamilton. I don't think I would be I think ideal for the championship. But uh, Leclerc. Ah, you go. Hamilton. Sainz. Norris. Alonso. Ocon. Pierre Gasly. Pierre, right. Um, it would be interesting to see if Max won and Hamilton retired and what Hamilton would be like actually having to play catch up like a 30 point gap. Yeah, because see, see my opinion, right? See if there's only like a race win. I mean, see if there's only like a first and second separating. You, I wouldn't consider you're trailing in the championship. No. I know. Even though Hamilton is trailing in the championship, in my opinion, I wouldn't consider it trailing the, the championship. See if you can guarantee. See if you can win the next race and guarantee you're going to be leading. I wouldn't really say you're trailing. Yeah. No. No, it's definitely if the gap's fifteen points because then you could be like, oh well. You know, all, if Hamilton wins the next race, and even if Max finishes in the top five, he, he's still leading the championship. So I mean, I'd con not, but I think, I mean, I don't think Hamilton will think, oh fuck, I'm, I'm not, I'm not winning the championship, I'm not le leading the championship. But I mean, oh, like no. you said, it would be interesting if the gap got to like a a full race win, like twenty five points. Put it this way: if Hamilton was the gap Bottas is behind, well, I think the dummy would be spat, man. He would probably be... claiming racism and <laughs> wanting the title postponed, COVID, fucking. It don't work for me, brother. Max is far right and all this stuff. Aye. Max's dad likes Tommy Robinson and all this. That would be he the... Actually, he actually kind of looks like that, bit. Oh, well, there you go. There boom. you go. Boom. Boom, Fucking boom. Tommy for start. Get Tommy in your room. Well, I guess that's it for the uh, prediction here, the preview. We'll uh, be back tomorrow. We'll see how practice is on. And uh, yeah, hopefully we have a good race. Good qualifying as well. Kill action scene, man. Monument. Monument. Monument.